Hello, this is a quick guide showing you how to upload and submit work to a specific assignment in Google Classroom. You want to do this to ensure that you are not putting uh, work into other folders or uh, posting it on the stream, but it's all going into the same place so that your teacher can easily assess your work. The first thing you need to do is you need to locate your assignments. There's two ways of doing this. Either you look in the main stream where the assignment has been posted. If you click on that, it will take you to the assignment. The other way is you can go into classwork. When you go into classwork, you will see that it comes up here, that for example, under literacy here, we can go in and click on that particular assignment and it will take us to it. So when we're in our assignment, it looks like this. You will see that there is an option to make class comments and there is an option to make private comments. The private comments will only be seen by you and your teacher. And that is a good way. Over here, everyone in the class will see it. So it might be that you have general comments or general questions that you feel that everyone in the class would benefit from hearing and therefore you can add it as a class comment. Up here in the corner, you will see that there is the work that you are expected to be doing. So it might be that your teacher have set you a specific document that you need to go in and work in and it will show up up here. When we click on this, it will take us to the task. So in this case, it is a grid um, there's 15 different tasks. And what the teacher would like you to do is they would like you to create another document um, solving all the various different tasks and making sure that you're doing the tasks. But they don't want you to do it in this particular document. This is just an information document. So when you go back in here, you will see that there is a little button underneath your work that says add or create. When you click on that, a drop down menu will come up and you can go in and choose what kind of work do you want to submit. So it might be that you have been asked, let's go in and see, a reading comprehension and you can follow the link and there is some uh, various different uh, questions that you need to answer. And then you could go in and say, okay, in order to create uh, or make a document with the answers, I want to create a new document. You can see that once you have created that, it automatically shows up over here under your work. Um, and this will ensure that it's directly linked to the assignment that you are doing right now. When you click on that, it will take you to a blank document and you could then go in and answer all the questions that was in the comprehension from the link. And once you have done that, you have just added, 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 it will automatically save. So you don't have to save anything. It's automatically saved under this. It might be that you have a document that you have already created, or it might be that your teacher have asked you to upload a picture. If that is the case, then you can also go in here and you can say you, can, you want to upload it from your drive. When you go in and upload it from your drive or from the computer that you're using, then you can go in and upload it and select it from your device. It might also be that it's already in your Google Drive, then you go in and locate it in your Google Drive, and then you add on it and you, add it to the uh, document of to your assignment so you can see now we have added this as part of our assignment once you feel that you're done you can hand it in if your teacher have instructed you to do so it might be that in some cases your teacher will have instructed you not to press hand in and in other cases that you would be allowed to do that that is how you add um, and ensure that the work that you're doing is directly linked to the assignment that you have been asked to do Thank you.